she shot to fame playing Downton Abbey's demure Lady Rose MacClare, but two years after the ITV drama ended Lily James is still trying hard to distance herself from her first major screen role. The 28-year-old was out in Soho in London this week, sporting an ensemble that would make the aristocratic Lady Rose gape in horror. Sporting white trainers, a black coat and a 195 pounds Burberry scarf, Lily made sure to playfully kick the air to show off her stripy tracksuit bottoms. I could live in you forever, she said of the clothes online. The 28-year-old was out in Soho in London this week, sporting an ensemble that would make the aristocratic Lady Rose gape in horror. She shot to fame playing Downton Abbey's demure Lady Rose MacClare, but two years after the ITV drama ended Lily James is still trying hard to distance herself from her first major screen role. Fifty Shades star Jamie Dornan swapped his sex-crazed cinematic alter ego for the role of doting husband on Tuesday night when he attended a charity gala in London with his wife of four years, Amelia Warner. The couple, who have two daughters, Dulcie, four, and Elva, 21 months, arrived arm in arm and remained inseparable throughout the night. Fifty Shades star Jamie Dornan swapped his sex-crazed cinematic alter ego for the role of doting husband on Tuesday night when he attended a charity gala in London with his wife of four years, Amelia Warner. Jamie, 35, cut a dash in a black suit while actress and musician Amelia, also 35, matched him in an elegant black dress. I've got to behave well tonight, he told me over dinner. I have to be up early tomorrow to fly to Jordan because I'm filming a private war with Rosamund Pike. As a left-winger who sent her son to private school, Shadow Home Secretary Diane Abbott is no stranger to hypocrisy. But even her most ardent supporters might struggle to defend her latest ruse to boost her £75,000 a year MP's income. Abbott took £1,500 for three hours' work to appear on a Sky TV show, the satirical Russell Howard Hour according to the latest register of MPs' financial interests. Sky is 39 per center owned by Rupert Murdoch's 21st Century Fox, which is trying to buy the channel outright. Abbott once likened Murdoch to Colonel Gaddafi, when she said Tony Blair being revealed as godfather to one of the media magnate's children was worse than the then-PM cozying up to the Libyan tyrant. TV cop Vicky has earned her strips, stepping out in London this week. She opted for a busy Yudin Choi nautical jumpsuit, which swamped her slender frame, and which she paired with turquoise ankle boots. Line of Duty star Vicky McClure can do no wrong when it comes to her screen performances from her role as Detective Sergeant Kate Fleming in the BBC police drama, to her BAFTA-winning performance in This Is England 86. But when it comes to sartorial matters, the 34-year-old actress who lives in Nottingham with her director boyfriend Johnny Owen might need a little more practice. Stepping out in London this week, she opted for a busy Yudin Choi nautical jumpsuit, which swamped her slender frame, and which she paired with turquoise ankle boots. I know what suits me and what designers I like, she explains. If I get a lot of clothes sent for an event, I'll know what I want to wear. But I'm a jeans girl. I've always been pretty casual, and that's not going to change I don't think.